the responsibility to protect legacy um, is is really progressive in terms of international law and in terms of protecting human rights and protecting populations around the world. It's a very thoughtful approach. It's a respectful approach. Um, and it, it attempts to bring um, some collaboration um, and, and the use of multilateral actions, so bringing in many different actors to solve a problem, including the state that it's in. So I think it's a, it really leaves a wonderful legacy. It's not perfect, and the implementation of R2B is never perfect. Politics is never perfect, and war isn't perfect. But it is something that Canada and Canadians should be proud of. And as we move forward into the future, actions like Libya can be studied and improved upon as time goes on, as we have more examples that we can draw from so that uh, the international community has more tools um, in order to, to protect these populations at risk.